President Donald Trump tweeting about the controversy concerning voter ID laws. Since 2018, Arkansas has upheld a strict photo ID requirement. Let's bring in KNWA's Andrew Epperson live in studio. And Andrew, how are state legislators responding to the president's tweet? Jennifer, the tweet comes in response to two election security bills that have passed through the House. One of the key elements of the legislation is to require candidates, campaign officials, and family members to notify the FBI if foreign governments offer assistance. Former special counsel Robert Mueller discovered Russia tampered with the 2016 election. Trump says it is all so meaningless to address election security without adding voter ID provisions to that legislation. Two Arkansas state senators have contrasting views on these laws, which are already implemented in most southern states. I certainly hope that's not the case, but we do know from time to time there, there's election fraud. Uh, and anything to continue to have more integrity in the system, I think, is good and appropriate. In-person voter fraud is just a myth. It just doesn't happen. But studies do show that voter ID laws do keep uh, legal voters from being able to cast a ballot. According to the Heritage Foundation, which is a conservative think tank, there have only been three cases of voter fraud in Arkansas history, two in this decade all resulted in criminal convictions. Trump first alleged widespread voter fraud when he tweeted millions of people voted illegally in the 2016 election. Live in studio, Andrew Epperson, KWA, Northwest Arkansas News.